Peter, when you tell people that you're the president of an aircraft company, you know, they're thinking big, shiny, new, complex, you know, running around with, uh, you know, the best of 2010 technology. How do you explain being the president of, of building w w WACO, rebuilding WACOs, I should say? Well, I tell you, WACO Classic is, is actually the world's smallest general aviation manufacturer. We make between f eh, five to six airplanes a year, sometimes eight. They're all custom ordered by each customer. The customer's picking the paint scheme, doing all the design work on the interior, avionics selection, and those types of things. But one thing interesting is we're making a brand new, big, beautiful biplane. It's fully certified for day, night, VFR, IFR flight. It features all sorts of modern uh, safety features and enhancements. Uh, glass panels are optional. Traffic systems, terrain systems, uh, really uh, comparable to any modern advanced general aviation airplane. Well, I have to tell you, based on the examples we see here, obviously the craftsmanship is way up there, and the airplanes you know, from day one have always looked absolutely stunning. Let's face it, this has got to be a, just an intriguing business to be in. I mean, we're in a tough economy. We've been through good, bad, whatever. But trying to sell something whose heyday was basically half a century ago and bring it now, I mean, it's got to be a labor of love for everybody from the buyer on down to each individual craftsman who gets their hands on one. It is, but interestingly enough, Waco Classic has weathered the downturn in aviation sales probably better than most manufacturers. You know, we're appealing to a niche pilot, uh, somebody who's an accomplished pilot, usually, but not always, but somebody's looking to experience just the outright joy of flight. It appeals to a different type of pilot or, or a pilot looking for something a little bit differently. You know, I used to own a uh, high-performance four-single, four-passenger single-engine airplane and, uh, you know, flying along at ten or 12,000 feet. You know, you get kind of bored up there sometimes. You know, on my trip today here uh, to St. Augustine, I spent most of my flight at about 500 feet, and I hate to admit it, at probably one point I was down to about 30 feet over a lake. The experience in the sound and the air and the visibility is just, uh, is just second to none. Cirrus Design's Vision SJ50 single-engine personal jet offers exceptional fuel efficiency, flexible seating for up to seven, advanced avionics, and all the Cirrus safety features you expect, including the Cirrus airframe parachute system. With its VTAIL design, the Cirrus Vision is technologically advanced, yet engineered to be simple to fly to allow owner pilots more lifestyle pursuits than any other personal aircraft. Learn more about the Vision SJ50 at CirrusDesign.com. Frequently I look back on history and looking back on, on Waco back in the 1930s, their advertising and their slogan was, Ask Any Pilot. And uh, you know, I challenge you to ask any Waco owner, and every one of them will say, I love my Waco. It's my favorite airplane ever in most cases. And uh, we had a, a whole uh, cadre of WACO uh, customers at uh, the recent uh, event down in uh, Lakeland. I asked several of them, you know, what's so special about your WACO? And they said, it's just the pure joy of flight. And these are customers who own business jets or TBMs or other, uh, you know, big heavy iron, but their WACO gives them an experience that they can't get anywhere else. Even though it's a, you know, it's an open cockpit airplane, it makes a fabulous cross-country cruising airplane. I think of one customer in particular who's a chairman of a large corporation, has any number of airplanes at his disposal. He flies his WACO to board meetings <laughs> and to meetings all over the country because to him, there's so much, it's just so much more exciting. We offer a different experience, but we offer the capability to get there in a reasonable amount of time. The airplane, um, you know, is, you know, speed-wise about Cessna 172 speed with, you know, effectively all, relatively all-weather capability. Uh, no icing, obviously, but, you know, at the factory, we've flown our test airplane down into the teens. Um, the airplanes now have a, what we call a winter weather kit, so it, you stay quite comfortable with heat in the both front and rear cockpits. How has this company weathered the storm? I mean, let's face it, we've got some amazing names that are all but gone. Mm -hmm. How has the WACO survived? Well, you know, again, we appeal to a very small niche. We sell very low volume. You know, if Cirrus did four airplanes this year, they'd be, they'd be in trouble. Uh, if I'm doing four, four airplanes, we're okay. You know, fully half of our business at Waco Classic is restoration work on all sorts of other vintage airplanes. So about half is selling new airplanes, and the other half is leveraging that same skill set that we use to build this airplane to restore, you know, warbirds and a litany of other types of 1920s to 1940s and 50s airplanes. 
If you own a Cirrus today or if you are considering the purchase of a new or used aircraft, consider this. Avidyne, in conjunction with the country's leading Cirrus sales and maintenance facilities, has launched the G3R9 program that combines the purchase of a late model, low time Cirrus aircraft and the addition of the Avidyne Integra Release 9 avionics suite for much less than you may have thought, and certainly much less than purchasing a brand new aircraft. G3R9, combining the best airframe, best engine, and best avionics for the best value. What's the process now? Okay, all of a sudden I win the lottery tomorrow, and first thing comes to my mind is whoa. Candy Apple Red, Waco Classic, I'm ready to go. What's the process like? Well, Waco as a small company, um, well, the first step is come to the factory. Or you don't have to, and we, you know, it's not, it's not a requirement. But certainly at the factory, we have about 25 people, and they're all incredible artisans, you know, building an airplane using traditional methods and new methods. There's a lot of, surprisingly, a lot of new technology used in manufacturing this airplane. But step one is, is obviously contact the factory. Step two is we work with the paint designer. We use a company called Scheme Designers. They will work hand in hand with you to design any paint scheme you want. If you wanted pink with orange polka dots, we'll do that for you. So we try to make the process very custom. It's very similar to a custom yacht or a custom home that's being built. Of course, many of our customers are at the four corners of the world. So we set up a discrete website where every week we post photos and information on the airplane so they can track its progress. They can share that, those progress reports with their friends and family or other aviators. Again, the big part of the process is we try to make it unique to them. Start to finish, from a metal fuselage to out the door are generally about four months. They can sometimes take longer if uh, unique options are fitted, like a smoke system where the avionics packages become extremely high tech, uh, per se. Of course, uh, in-house we have a full-time avionics department, a uh, full-time paint department, and all of the, all the work on the airplane is accomplished in the building. Well, a couple of the options that you don't see on the average general aviation airplane, one obviously a smoke system, but then again, how do you not put a smoke system in an airplane like this. But I also notice you're outfitting a great deal of your customer airplanes with uh, in-cockpit video. We are, and uh, you know, the video systems are popular both with customers so they can film their flights. In addition, uh, a large segment of our, uh, our customer base are ride operators. Ride operators appreciate the fact that it's a new airplane, and so do their customers who are riding in an airplane. They appreciate the fact that there's factory support and factory part avail availability. And of course, you know, a video on this airplane is a, a fantastic way to record just an unbelievable experience. Indeed. And boy, talk about a perfect uh, bit of canvas to shoot out of. Absolutely. Again, the visibility um, is, uh, is second to none in most airplanes. And the fact that, uh, you know, with the visibility comes, you know, all the, uh, the excitement and the, um, the visceral thrill of flying a 300 horsepower open cockpit airplane.